even, um, I don't know if you've heard of Red. Mm. It's also a band that influences us a lot. Um, yeah, Red Lincoln Park, Evanescence. Um, I'd oh, say Breaking I, Benjamin. Breaking Beethoven, Benjamin. Beethoven. Park, <laughs> I, I, I'd say Creed, but he might kill me. <laughs> <laughs> You know, the, I think everybody knows that the scene is kind of down right now after Jillian's closed down. I mean, it was kind of a big drop off for Las Vegas, but I mean, I mean, there's good bands here. I mean, we, we just got to bring it back. You know, it's it's difficult and it takes a lot of work and it takes a big effort on everybody's part, and bands and fans included. But uh, I don't know. Hopefully, we can bring it back to where it was, like 2004, 2005, because it was really good then. It's, it's tough for our genre, really. I mean, we're, we're doing our best and have great fans and showing up and stuff, but really, it's, it's very genre specific. It's, uh, you guys have female fronted band, obviously. What's it feel like to be part of the, the small number of bands here that have a female front band? Well, I know that whenever I tell people about our band, they're like, well, what do you sound like? And I'm like, oh, we're like alternative rock, a little bit of metal. They are sleeping all the time. But then I say, yeah, we got a female vocalist. Really? A female vocalist? Oh, it's like they've never heard of it before. Yeah. So, what does it feel like to you just being the female lead? It feels pretty good. Feels good. <laughs> <laughs> you feel like one of the guys, or yeah, kind of, just but a little bit different. Just a little bit prettier, that's all. Yeah. <laughs> it's gotta be more of a pretty person instead of a, you know, more boyish rock. Especially hanging out with us. Yeah. Somebody's gotta be the good looking one. <laughs> yeah, seriously. <laughs>